Once again, I extend a very warm welcome to all you beautiful people there, those who have joined this MOOC Massive Open Online course on Google Classroom. And I hope that all of you would be benefited and all of you are welcome to subscribe the channel in order to continue this MOOC course, which is freely available for all inquisitive learners. So we start the first module of creating a Google Classroom here in this uh, to YouTube video, you would see that uh, how you can create a class. Here when you see, or you really want to create a class, there are two options. You can see a Google search bar here, and you can also see some applications here, which are the Google apps. And if you have a Gmail account, you can easily avail all these apps. So I would suggest you to create your own Google account in order to keep pace with this MOOC and also to avail all the Google apps here. Secondly, if you want to create your class, you can search the bar or you can go straight away from the apps available here. When you scroll down, you come across this icon, which is for classroom with the classroom mentioned over here. So as you click, it will directly take you to the Google Classroom. And if you don't have this account, you can simply look for or search for Google Classroom. It will show you the various options and you can click on Google Classroom. This is how it would take you to the Google Classroom. You won't find anything on this screen if you don't have any previously created Google class. So this would be all empty. Now the question is how to create a class. You would get this icon here. This is the main menu, the Google classroom written at the left hand side. In the right hand side, you will find a sign for class where two options you will come across that is to join the class and then to create the class once you click on join the class the first option available it asks you to give you the code that is supplied by the teacher so this is available for the students when you create a class and you share the code your student can fill the code here and can join your particular class or any event that is on google classroom you just type in the code here and you can attend that event or the class and then there is the second option to create the class here you can go through the various privacy and security protection instructions as you select this this continue option will be available for you and you can go to create a class here it first of all ask a set of questions is here the class name and if you create a class say i want to create a free mooc on google classroom As you mention your class name, if you want to create a class for your say class six or class seven or BSc, BEd, BCom, any class you could mention over here. Then there is the option of section. Just mind it as you mention the name of the class, you have this create sign over here, which previously was not active. So even if you don't fill in the section, the subject in the room, you can simply create a class here. But if you have a section, say section A, B, C, you can mention that. If you specify the subject, you can write it over here. And then simply you can move to your class by clicking on the create icon. As you click the icon, you will come across your class, which has already been created for you. And you will see the class right on the screen. If you have many classes, you can add to the class or you would have your very first class here. So it's here that is free MOOC on Google 
classroom, which is for you. The important thing here to note is this class code. Once I share this class code with you, you can join this particular class by again going to the same option that of join and pasting this code which I would share with you in this video. And here when you click over here, it shows you the bigger view. So as you create your class, you can copy this code from here and you can paste at your desired point. You can share it through WhatsApp or through Facebook, your secret Facebook or your particular classroom groups where students can have access to this code and can join your class then secondly you see this background here no if you want to change this background you can just go to the themes here select theme and upload photo if you want to have a particular photo at the background you can click here i would prefer to select from the themes which are already available to save time and we come across so many themes journal english and history mathematics and science arts sports and others so according to your you know subject you can select any suitable theme and uh, for the mooc uh, say i would select this theme and uh, we select this and here you can say you have the option here for select and to put it as a theme at the background and you will see that the theme is changed and now it is ready for my free MOOC on Google Classroom. So you can do the same and you can see the class over here when you see the, the main title here is stream, classwork, people and grades. This is particular window is for streams where you can see the streams you can communicate with the class and you can share your students the moment you register with this code here to this group you would find my welcome address here as i say hello a big welcome to all of you to this MOOC, fine. So, and I post it here. Once you come in and join this class for Google Classroom, you will find this topic, this message here. So, this is the stream. Now, second, you can explore where you can post your material your assignment the resources where i will post i will give you the youtube video the assignment and you can do the same for your students here you can directly communicate with your students you can post all the notices here all the announcements you can post to the class and they can see at the main page here on their class and just clicking to the classroom you would come across the matter that is to create option you can create assignment here the questions here and you can use topics to organize classwork or into modules or units and you can order the same so in a very systematic manner the material you post to your student would be available to them and you can also sequence the material the way you want the material you want to share from the google uh, the the what you call the youtube or from the powerpoint presentations available at various sites you can do here you can also post your own e-content so it is very helpful to the students and the teachers as well as every data is saved in a digital manner and here in, under the people option you can add the teachers you can add the students this we will show in the upcoming videos and then you can also create the students you can maintain their trade book so my dear friends this was all about 
creating your own Google class and joining it.